This is one of my favorite places in the forest. I know. Such pretty flowers around here. Pika! Look, it's Team Rocket. But it looks like they're leaving, thankfully. I wonder what they were doing around here. But I wonder even more how I can grow flowers like these. I've never seen anything like them. Yeah, they are pretty awesome. I would grow a whole garden if I knew what made them grow like that. Let's call Ciara at the Learning League Lab. Maybe she could tell you how. Good idea. I want to know the secret of flower power. Hi, Ash. How's it going, May? Good timing. I just got back inside after planting some flowers in our lab's garden. Flowers? You're right about good timing. That's why we called. Yeah, I want to grow some like these. They basically look like the other flowers around here, but I've never seen patterns like that. Hmm, those are amazing. I've never seen anything like them either. How did they get like that? I'm not quite sure, but maybe by telling you what I know about raising my plants, that'll help you figure out how to grow them. Great. Well, then let's take a closer look. In fact, let's take a really close look. Plants are made up of tiny building blocks called cells. Whoa, they're tiny, right? Absolutely. In fact, you can only see them under a microscope. Take a look. One plant cell coming up. Hey, it's shaped kind of like a rectangle with lots of weird little things inside. Weird nothing. Those things are what make a plant a plant, or a flower a flower. They're called organelles. Organelles? That sounds like little organs. Right, sort of like the organs in our bodies. Except these are in the plant and flower cells, and just like organs in our body, they each have a special job. Which one is in charge? <laughs> I should have known you guys would want to know that first. That's the nucleus. It controls all of the cell's activity. Gotcha. The nucleus knows all the news about the plant because it's in control. What's next? Those green chloroplasts. Why is there more than one? Because they're so important. The chloroplasts are where photosynthesis takes place. They create food for the cell and give a plant its green color. Okay, chloroplasts, the green food machine. Next, meet the mitochondria, the power plants of the cell. They change the food into energy the cell can use. Now, on to the vacuole. The vacuum? Close. Vacuoles. The cell storage bins for everything. Food, poison, even color pigments for flower petals. Many plants have one big vacuole. It fills with water so it can help the plant stand upright. Oh, wow. So does that mean if there's not enough water in the vacuoles, a plant will wilt? You got it, May. Only three parts to go, and two are related. The cell membrane and the cell wall. The cell membrane is like a guard. It controls what materials go in and out of the cell. And then the cell wall. It's like the outer wall of a house. It protects the cell and gives it shape. That makes sense. Wait, you said there were three parts left. I don't see any other parts. That's because the cytoplasm doesn't have a shape like the other organelles. It's the jelly-like substance around the other parts. Cytoplasm. The gushy stuff. I get it. Well, there you go. A plant cell. So, are you ready for a little challenge? I'm ready if you are. I'm ready to grow my own flower. All right, let's do it. We got two. All right then. Here are two lists. One of cell organelles and the other of their functions. Can you match each part with its function? Each correct match will make my own flower grow. Click on a part, then click on its function. Here's a hint: materials can pass through it. A match. All right then. Here are two lists: one of cell organelles and the other of their functions. Can you match each part with its function? Each correct match will make my own flower grow. Click on a part, 
then click on its function. Here's a hint. Materials can pass through it. Perfect! Remember, it's like the wall of a house. Perfect! They give a cell its get up and go. Great! You remembered! Think of a sea of soft stuff. A match! Hungry cells need them. Perfect! Knows everything and makes it happen. A match! Great! You remembered! Awesome! A perfect score! Seven matches! My flower grew so big! But it's white! I don't understand! I grew the same kind as we saw in the woods! Weird! If you ask me, it's time to go snooping! Yeah! Ciara, thanks for all your help explaining plants. Now we need to take a closer look. Okay, good luck! Okay, let's get some samples of these flowers! May! Help! Pika! This must be the work of Team Rocket! Hold on, Ash and Pikachu! I'm coming! Okay, Ash and Pikachu need some rescuing. Will you help by labeling the parts of this cell? For each part that lights up, find its name and drag it into place. For each correct answer, we'll be able to lower the rope closer to Ash and Pikachu. Are you all right? Yeah, thanks for the help. Pikachu! Of course Team Rocket would have to put a trap in the prettiest flower patch. They'll do anything to catch Pikachu. Pikachu! At least I got some of the flowers. Okay, let's imagine we found a blue and red flower and a white flower, but otherwise they seem the same. What part relates to flower petal color? Here's what we're looking for. The vacuole. It stores pigment that colors flower petals. Okay, here we go. Let's look at both of these flowers. Click on a slide to see what one of the flower cells looks like under the microscope. Check out the pigment color in the vacuole. When you're ready, click on the other slide to compare the vacuole from the other flower cell. To report what you found, click Check. What did you see when you looked at the flower cells under the microscope? Click on your answer. Yeah! When we investigated, we found that although they were red and blue on the outside, they were otherwise identical to the white flowers. So thanks to Ciara, now we know to look at the pigment and see if they're different. Actually, wait just a second. If you look really close, the patterns kind of look like ours. And we did see Team Rocket. R for Team Rocket! Of course. They must have painted the flowers. 
Let's see what we caught with our trap. The boss will be so pro us, we'll get a promotion. Uh oh. Looks like the trap got Pikachu, but the twins got to it first. Now how are we gonna get our big catch? You won't if we're around. And now we're going to catch you. Pika B! Try again. No match there. If you need a hint, click Hint. That was a lot of information, wasn't it? How about trying those matches again? Okay, I think you're getting it. <coughs> Try again. Well, actually, we found that even though the flowers are different colors, they were otherwise identical, and the pigment is the same, white. So thanks to Ciara, now we know to look at the pigment and see if they're different.